It may look like a top tier handset, but the HTC One Mini 2 is actually the company's new star mid-ranger, and it's got a lot to offer. It's a thing of beauty thanks to a milled aluminium body that wraps around at the edges, making it easy to hold with a great feel in the hand. There are pop-out trays on either side for a nano SIM and memory cards up to a whopping 128GB. There's also a volume rocker and a power lock key on the top, but unlike its bigger brother the One M8, no IR blaster means TV buffs will have to stick to their standard remotes for channel surfing. The front of the One Mini 2 features a 4.5 inch 720p HD LCD that is bright, colourful and works surprisingly well outside in direct sunlight. Topped and tailed by HTC's distinctive boom sound speakers, they push out impressive sound for their size, but the added height does make you question whether calling this a mini phone is really appropriate. It's just as big as last year's top HTC, the One M7. Power the Mini 2 up and you'll get the latest version of Android KitKat covered in HTC's own custom interface, Sense 6.0. Compared to most other UIs out there, Sense is one of the cleanest, well thought out versions on offer. The notifications panel comes with quick toggles for things like Bluetooth, Wi-Fi and hotspot mode. There are handy tools like a flashlight and a car mode for driving, and HTC Blinkfeed is just a swipe away from your main home screen, offering news, stories and social feeds you care about. Sense 6 also runs impressively smoothly thanks to a quad-core processor, and it can handle the latest 3D games with aplomb. Connectivity falls to the mod cons we already mentioned, plus GPS, 4G LTE and NFC, something that last year's One Mini lacked. The Snapdragon 400 silicon at its heart isn't as power efficient as Qualcomm's newer processors, so expect the One Mini 2 to last a day on a single charge, but no more. The 2110 mAh battery is probably the sorest point of the phone's construction. Shutterbugs will appreciate the 5 megapixel front facer and the dedicated selfie mode as well as the mammoth 13 megapixel camera on the back. Unlike HTC's flagship handset, the camera on the One Mini 2 is more conventional, letting you take decent photos in well lit conditions with a flare for macro, as well as being able to shoot full HD slow or fast motion video. Just steer clear of low light situations where noise and grain will enter into your shots in abundance. The HTC One Mini 2 is a well rounded smartphone that looks and feels great to use. You'll appreciate the slick user experience, the metal bodywork and expandability it offers. If you're buying it SIM free however, don't count out last year's HTC One M7. It comes with a better screen, a faster processor and it costs less. 